Hello, I'm Juliet. Welcome back. I thank you for joining me. Here we are. If you're coming back after watching the video where we shared with you our elephant mold, where we used the micas and painted them on, and you want to see another way of doing it, thank you and i hope you subscribed and that's how you saw this notice for this video if not please check that video above on how we made the other elephant and now we are making this african savannah sunset using this elephant mold using the marble uh, effect of resin and to see how we do that please stay with me and i hope you've subscribed and pressed the notification bell so that you don't miss out on more of my videos and if you want to see more posts because i try to post more often on instagram please follow me on instagram at juliet megui inspires all right so what will we need of course we'll need this mold i'll show you how we'll mix the resin that we will use for this and lots of lots of combination of colors so we're going to use this may spring charcoal black we're going to use this royal gold uh, may spring also may spring bronze stone we're going to use this wine red may spring also and the yellow that I have in mica is this fantasy, fantasy yellow uh, from the Say So pack. And everything I use is in the description below if you'd like to order some through the links I have shared. Then we have the Picasso Marigold, we have the Picasso Sunset, Picasso Lemon, and Picasso Terracotta. All these are to give us the sunset effect for the stand we'll also use uh, this zigzaggy mold it's usually the one for candle holders standing cut pillar candle holders but i'm using it for making my stand and i'll show you how and remember i've already shown you how in the video i should have told you to watch all right what else this is African scene, but if you want the real deal, please check the card above where I showed you our Maasai Mara trip, where you'll see the real giraffes and the real animals, which inspired me to do this video. So I'm going to wear my protective gloves, my face mask, and show you how we're going to do this.
we are just about to demold our elephant did you get a chance to watch my video my Vegas video because in there I have shared with you the Bellagio conservatory in Las Vegas and they have a beautiful set of uh, artificial wild animals it's not the same like in the Mara the one I told you but still worth visiting so let's demold this take it this is the back but it still looks so pretty at the back we don't have to do anything more to it let's see the other side what you've been waiting for and let me know in the comment section below when you look at the two elephant this one and the one I had asked you to watch the one with mica powder which one would you choose so let's see <laughs> oh wow this one I just love them mm. I just love the vividness of the color you know you can see the different colors here it's interesting the orange always gets lost because when you looked at it from the other side the before putting black this you could see the orange defined nicely the yellows but I think every time I get a new idea and I think maybe on the next one tell me what you think maybe on the next one before putting the black over this this sunset part and I can see when it affects this Sun I should put a white layer so that these other colors are more vivid so you can see even with the bronze you can see the black coming out but there's nothing wrong with it it's just a different color a different outcome but every time i want to see what could be better so follow me on instagram and check it out because i think i won't do another video because it will be the same process apart from adding that white but follow me on instagram at juliet Migu inspire so that you can't see it when I finally share it but I love it so keep watching because now I'm going to put the stand so that uh, you can see how it looks when it's standing with the stand that we had started making stand is cured that's after 24 hours I love how the casting cures well so we're not just going to demold it and then you just look at the end for the photos on how it looks when it's standing but I love it please don't forget to subscribe and press the notification bell so that you don't miss out on such videos and if you'd like more of this kind and sometimes i don't post on youtube please check uh, follow me on instagram at juliet megway inspires because there i post more and loads more all right here goes always be careful of your corners that they don't tear so remove or detach from the corners elegant so we'll just tidy up these bits then I have take a photo for you wow I love this African scene 
Oh, African Savannah. So God bless you. Barakatala. See you next time.